Downey Live, live on Downey Street. So today is day two of our motorcycle touring experience. We have woken up here in Revelstoke. Look how beautiful it is. It's August and there is snow on the mountains behind us. So we're sort of towards the interior on the edge of the Rockies. We are gonna be heading south into Kimberley today. And, and this is what we're riding. If you weren't with us yesterday, 2012 Triumph Street Triple 675 CC. This is my sister Jess. I'm Mike. Wow. Wow. Every corner is more wow. Honestly, I like. This is one of my favorite stretches of highway in the world. And I, I was thinking that based on memory and I was like, oh, maybe I'm over exaggerating. And every corner we go around, it gets better and better. I mean, look at that, look at that. Not a lot of traffic in this section, steady traffic. Which is nice compared to driving through Kelowna. Yeah, and it's not tight, scary corners. It's long, winding corners. Uh, freshly paved road, it's black asphalt with that bright yellow line. It's just so smooth. Mike's heaven. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. We've now arrived in Golden, BC, and the town is adorable. Been on the road for about two hours, so we're gonna, gonna pop into this bookstore slash cafe and get a coffee. And we're gonna chug a lot of water because I'm feeling dehydrated. Good coffee and sandwich to refill us, but I have to admit that uh, we forgot there was a one hour time change as we came from Revelstoke to here. So uh, we gotta hit the road again because we've got, we gotta be in Kimberley. What's that? How's the day? <laughs> it's starting to heat up a bit now. Yeah. It was like 12 degrees this morning when we started. So it's nice and chilly and it's warmed up to pretty much double that at this point. So nice and warm now. right hand side with these low rolling hills to the right but to your left were massive steep jagged rocky mountains and we're headed to the Trickle Creek Resort so but we have to be there at a certain time and we forgot about the time zone change so we're we're a little behind schedule so we're gonna keep moving we've been taking bugs to the face like crazy I don't know if you can see this but this was a big guy bam and I took a couple of massive dragonflies to the chest it was like taking bullets up there Oh yeah, already relaxed. Fireplace, sweet lounging area, little kitchenette. What more do you want? This is perfect for a long day on the motorcycle. Long day? Yeah. Ready for the pool? Long day. We're gonna hit the pool tomorrow. The whole reason we're here is Jess and I have never been mountain biking before and we're going mountain biking tomorrow. So tomorrow is a day off from the motorcycle on a, a day on a different bike, basically. Pool now. You know what comes after this, right? A walk through town. Because the whole reason I've, we, I, we, us, we, the whole reason that we came to Kimberley is because it's a town in BC that we've never been to. We've been all across BC, driving back and forth from Vancouver to Calgary, but Kimberley is off the beaten path. It's not on a main freeway, highway, thoroughfare. If you're coming to Kimberley, it's because you've taken the exit to go off the highway and come to Kimberley. So here we are. Look, Jess, it even has, even has paddles. Jess, come here. But it, it actually has paddles and balls. Wow. This is in the main street. It's, the whole downtown is blocked off. It's pedestrians only. And they leave the paddles out. It's a kitchen supply company called The Greater Good. Adorable. It, it kind of has a bit of a Bavarian theme to it. What a beautiful night. They have chess too. Just make sure to put the pieces back as you found them. So this is Kimberly. We made it. 
That was the plan for today. Success. This is Jess. I'm Mike. And this is what I do. I'm an adventure vlogger slash behind the scenes, but today was definitely on the adventure travel side. So come back tomorrow to see us explore Kimberly and show you more about small towns in BC, essentially. Woo! Subscribe down below because, well, I do know where I'm going tomorrow. I'm staying here, but otherwise I don't know where I'm going and I want you there with me. And if you watch this channel, you know why that's important. See you then. Just a little update, that black thing right there is a bear. It's a black bear walking in the distance. We are uh, on our way home and Kimberly is a wild place. Did I say we're walking home? We're obviously taking the motorcycle. <laughs> I don't know, he's like five or six feet long, tall, long. How do you measure a bear?